What's up guys, today's video is on the top 5 best budget smartphones. Through extensive research and testing, I've put together a list of options that'll meet the needs of different types of buyers. So whether it's price, performance, or its particular use, we've got you covered. For more information on the products, I've included links in the description box down below, which are updated for the best prices. Like the video, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Now, let's get started. If you're looking for the top bang for the buck, we especially single out for you the Motorola Moto G Power. Best value budget smartphone available on the market and version of the Moto G Power kicks things up a notch. With a 50 megapixel camera and a new body plastic texture, as well as a different rear camera arrangement. We also have additional storage with 64 gigabytes on the lower end and a 128 gigabyte option for an extra charge. However, the three day battery life is the biggest selling point of the Moto G Power series. That's a huge advantage over iPhone devices, for example. Included accessories for the Moto G are minimal as usual these days, but not so minimal that it doesn't include a charger. You'll also receive a SIM tray removal tool. Focusing on the Moto G Power battery, it's the main feature that stands out for sure. The Moto G Power has a MediaTek Helio G37 processor with 4GB of RAM and 64GB or 128GB of built-in storage. There's a micro SD card slot for memory upgrade up to 512GB, which is always useful for users, of course. This is a cool unit with a triple camera and a fingerprint scanner disguised as the brand's logo. The same goes for the 8 megapixel selfie camera at the top of the screen. The 6.5 inch IPS screen is quite good too. Of course, the resolution of 1600 by 720 pixels is modest by today's standards and does not provide good image clarity, but these shortcomings can be forgiven for a bright contrasting image with a refresh rate of 90 hertz. There is no stereo sound, but a dedicated headphone jack is left for music lovers. For the listed price, you can't beat this one. If you're searching for the best and highest quality cam camera, look no further than the Google Pixel 6a. Also known as the best camera budget smartphone on the market, the Google Pixel 6a inherits not only the processor of other pixels, but also the entire design line that the company introduced with the 6 series. The design is clean, the colors are typically Google style, and continue to have the horizontal camera bump which is, however, smaller in this model. The entire front area is occupied by a 6.1-inch Samsung OLED panel, while the back is made of high-quality plastic. In fact, the plastic used for the back cover of the Google Pixel 6a is one of the best seen in this price range, and the smartphone feels premium as soon as you hold it, despite being very light. The Google Pixel 6a has 128GB of internal storage, which is fast, but not super fast and 2 gigabytes less RAM than the other two components in the series. The 6 gigabytes of RAM is more than enough to handle the vast majority of most common tasks. The device offers a dual rear camera combo built into a strip-shaped module. The primary camera is similar to the one installed on the Google Pixel 5 with a 12.2 megapixel sensor. The wide-angle camera mounts 12 megapixels and a viewing angle of 114 degrees. It reaches 60 FPS in 1080p video recording and 4K at 30 FPS. The Google Pixel 6a boasts the famous Google camera, which offers all the computing potential of the company. There's no noticeable drop in quality compared to this model's older brothers. It can also offer an excellent dynamic range. The camera app allows you to compensate for exposure, contrast, and temperature when adjusting focus. In addition, it's possible to apply night mode as Google Pixel 6a saves an exceptional amount of light, even from dim scenes, and also receive notifications with the best framing for shots. The front camera performs at a very good level, especially in portrait mode. Highly recommended. OnePlus Nord N25G also known as the best display budget smartphone available on the market. The smartphone has a 6.43-inch AMOLED display that looks great and offers top-notch viewing angles. It's an FHD Plus panel with a 20 to 9 aspect ratio. Inside, there's a Qualcomm Snapdragon 695 processor, 6 gigabytes of RAM, and 128 gigabytes of UFS 2.2 storage, expendable up to 512 gigabyte via micro SD card just enough for most users. Immediately striking are the two large camera modules protruding from the flat back panel. While we're on the back panel, it's made of polycarbonate material with a nice matte finish that doesn't show fingerprints, which is a refreshing change. On the left and right side of the phone, 
you'll find the volume control and the power button. There is no mute switch like what you'll find on the OnePlus 10 Pro, but there is a headphone jack on the bottom of the phone. The camera setup here is pretty basic. The main camera is a 64 megapixel shooter, flanked by a 2 megapixel macro lens and a 2 megapixel monochrome lens. Video recording is superb at 1080p at 30fps. On the front, you get a single 16 megapixel f2.4 lens. Unfortunately, the cameras here are not the best, but they do the job nonetheless. This device is fine for posting photos on Instagram or Facebook, but that's enough for many users. Color reproduction is pretty solid. As for video, during the day recording clips works just fine. As we mentioned, it maxes out at 1080p, which isn't amazing, but the front-facing camera has electronic image stabilization that does a pretty good job of smoothing out images as you walk. Battery life is pretty good for the home lifestyle. You'll end days with 40% or more charge after about 3 or 4 hours with the screen on. As for charging, the OnePlus Nord ships with a 33 volt charger in the box, which we still appreciate, environmental concerns aside. Thumbs up, that's for sure. For all you Apple fans, we especially single out the iPhone SE. This model has a design that's already known to all iPhone users, which is comfortable, but it's also true that aesthetically it's a pretty old design. Despite this, this device does not disappoint, as it's small and can be carried in any pocket. It has an HD display, which is a 4.7 inch IPS, with a resolution of 1334 by 750 pixels, leaving behind the 326 pixels per inch that the iPhone endured for so many years while the competition screens grew. This means that the device delivers a good experience at the level of sharpness. If we talk about refreshing the screen, it's somewhat less fluid than the iPhone 13, but it's still pretty fast and comfortable. There's a rear camera with a 12 megapixel sensor with deep fusion and smart HDR4 technologies, along with a front facing camera with 7 megapixel sensor. Unfortunately, you won't be able to enjoy the night mode in this model, which is missing. However, smart HDR4, deep fusion, and photo styles have been added, as in the iPhone 13. As for video recording, we must highlight the excellent stabilization that all iPhones have and which stands out in this new SE model. You can appreciate the fluidity and smoothness with which you can record videos. In addition, you'll be able to rotate the footage without shaking the mobile phone and without it being noticed in the final result. The 4K recording option is another highlight and can be used for clearer recording at night. One of the things that this model can boast is power. Although it's not in the top line of Apple mobile phones, it has one of the best mobile processors from Apple, the A15 Bionic, which will provide you with extremely fast performance. There is also a 64 gigabytes of RAM. This is a quality product and all we can do is recommend it. On the title of the best overall budget smartphone available on the market, meet the Samsung Galaxy A53 5G. This is one of Samsung's most popular smartphones and is a very interesting mid-range option. The device includes a high refresh rate screen, the latest software, a stylish body with waterproof protection, and a versatile camera system. Samsung implemented small changes such as a bigger battery and a higher screen refresh rate while changing the design. Having said that, it should be noted that the new chip seems to help a lot in the photography and video department. Samsung opted for a 5 nanometer Exynos 1280 5G chip for the Galaxy A53 5G and equipped it, in addition to 5G connectivity, with a super AMOLED screen with a 120Hz refresh rate. The Samsung Galaxy A53 5G has a waterproof case and an attractive matte back. The Super AMOLED display supports HDR10+, and the 64 megapixel main camera has optical image stabilization and 2 times lossless zoom, while the 12 megapixel ultrawide camera has a larger sensor than most cameras in this price range. The strong points are completed by stereo speakers, a large battery with a relatively fast charging process, and a fingerprint scanner under the screen. The Galaxy A53 5G is a budget range smartphone, but its body packs a few premium features. The Gorilla Glass 5 front panel is highly appreciated. The plastic frame is beautiful with its glossy finish, while the plastic back has an amazing matte coating which is really fascinating and fingerprint resistant. The phone is dust and water resistant to IP67 and can survive up to 30 minutes when 3 feet underwater. The screen reaches a maximum brightness of 378 nits when the brightness is adjusted manually, and in sunlight mode, the screen reaches up to 800 nits. The display conforms to the DCI-P3 in vibrant mode or sRGB in natural mode. The accuracy of the Vivid Profile is excellent. 
The Galaxy A53 5G battery has a capacity of 5000 mAh and can support fast charging at 25 volts. It's certainly a robust battery, which has proven itself in the daily use of the device. It lasted a full day of heavy use with the 120Hz refresh rate on. Setting it to a 60Hz refresh rate, the battery lasts two days without issue. Overall, this model delivers premium performance at the best possible price-quality ratio. You wanted the best, you got it. So that's it for the top 5 best budget smartphones in